this film I want to talk about my way of painting with watercolours. I'm a great believer in pure watercolours. Another thing I'm very keen on is doing plenty of painting out of doors. One can paint in the studio extremely well, but one must draw one's inspiration from nature. And I paint at least 75% of my work out of doors. get steep little bits of bank in snow showing the earth comes through. And you see these patches of dark show up the snow very valuably. I'd like to say a little bit about actual colour mixing. You sometimes get a touch of yellow in a, a grey sky. first thing is to tackle the sky. I like to damp with clear water the sky area and I'm bringing the clouds down over the buildings but painting this grey over, over buildings but carefully leaving the areas that I shall eventually want to be dead white. One always wants to bear in mind with painting landscapes to simplify and leave out. The great thing is to learn how much to leave out and how much to put in. One can go on putting in and spoil a picture very easily indeed. And so you've got to exercise the necessary restraint. I'd like to go a little further into architecture, give you some more um, building details. And I've got here a very interesting subject of old knowledge. Now, I'd like to mention bridges. They are very attractive subjects to paint. The general composition of this picture is rather satisfying. The barn here is left of centre. The darkest dark is in the big door opening, which gives a punch, an emphasis. One of the most important things of the whole painting is this tree shadow on the building. This really brings the thing to life.